Hello, Malcolm here, and welcome to the Thames Valley Churches of Christ podcast, part of a special series for the months of January and February 2019, whilst we're studying the Gospel of John together. These podcasts are designed to be a short daily stimulus to our devotional times around the text of the Gospel. Now, on to today's episode. Today's word is sun. That's S-O-N, not S-U-N. You've probably noticed that in John's Gospel, Jesus is described as the Son of God with a particular emphasis. We see that in the other Gospels, eight times in Mark, ten times in Luke, and fifteen times in Matthew, but John uses this term, Son of God, twenty-five times. And indeed, God is referred to as a Father about a hundred times. A significant emphasis. It's not that Jesus is only called the Son by the narrator. There are lots of references which I'll put in the show notes for that. But he also uses it for himself. He calls himself the Son of God in debate with the Jews and other places. And again, I'll put the references in the show notes. And of course, people complain that he ought to die because he claimed to be the Son of God in chapter 19. Jesus himself says, I and the Father are one. Chapter 10, verse 30. So what does it mean to you that Jesus is so clearly the Son of the Father? What does this say about the relationship between the two of them? What do you learn about the way they worked together as Father and as Son, in perfect harmony, yet with different roles, so that Jesus' mission and his purpose could be accomplished for your benefit and mine? Perhaps a prayer focus could be something like this. Father, please help me to understand what it means that Jesus is your son. I wish to be that kind of son to you. Thank you for listening to today's episode. Please send us your comments or any questions. More information can be found on our website, tvcoc.org, the Facebook page, the Twitter feed and the YouTube channel. Whatever happens today, remember what Jesus said in John 14, verse 23. Anyone who loves me will obey my teaching. My Father will love them, and we will come to them and make our home with them. Until the next time, take care. And God bless.